دین ہے دین دین All right, Mr. Finch, I'm here to ask you some questions. Listen, I was just fishing. You didn't have any authority to come aboard and arrest me. Now I demand my phone call. Please calm down. I know how the law works. You don't have any cause to hold me here. Where is the cocaine that you were transporting for Alonzo Medina? Medina? Maniac Medina? The drug lord? I don't have anything to do with him, nor any cocaine. You'll be a bit more cooperative after night in the hole, Mr. Finch. I will have your badge for this. Mr. Finch, how was your evening? I hope the accommodations were to your liking. I hear most people find it um, unpleasant. Do you really think? that you could somehow scare me into a false confession? No matter what you do, you're not gonna get anything out of me. You seem to misunderstand the situation here. This isn't a test of endurance. I always get what I'm after. Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, but not this time. I can make your life very unpleasant. Just tell me where you've hidden the cocaine. You've got the wrong guy. Don't say that I didn't warn you, Mr. Finch. This is all wrong. You're cops. You can't do this. This isn't legal. I have rights. Unfortunately for you, people who don't exist don't get the luxury of having rights. What the fuck are you talking about? Mr. Finch doesn't exist, does he, Mr. Locke? It was difficult to track down your file. But I see, Mr. Locke, so many indiscretions in here. How the fuck did Vandalism, you... fraud, petty theft, yet not a single conviction. Why would you go and do something as big and stupid as smuggling cocaine? You've got the wrong guy. I swear to God, I don't know anything about any coke. Mr. Locke, think long and hard about the situation you're in. Medina. Medina. Mr. Locke, you're not looking so good today. Where did all your fight go? Where's the man that sat before me? Please. Please stop this. Just let me go. <laughs> let you go? I've been trying to let you go from the beginning. Just tell me where the cocaine is. I can't! They'll kill my family, don't you get it? I have to protect my family. How, Mr. Locke, can you protect your family from in here? I'm really sorry that it had to be this way. You know, your wife says that strange men have been coming by the house, asking about you. Most of them not looking too friendly. If I tell you, if I tell you where the coke is, will you protect my family? Last time, Mr. Locke, where is the cocaine? It's above, above the ceiling tiles in my son's room. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mr. Locke. That's all we needed. Are you going to let me go? Oh, we never had any intention of letting you go. But for what it's worth, you were a valued employee before you decided to steal from Mr. Medina. But I'm afraid your services are no longer required.